Good morning, pioneers. I'm so excited that you are joining me today for our morning meeting. Um, we have done lots of fun things this week, um, but today we have some cool activities. So today we are going to do this activity called Catching Firefly, Fireflies in Its Capacity. All right, so you'll, you have this in your take-home packets or you can find it on the printable link on the online resources on your tackles report. And you see there's different lines. So what we want you to do before you do the activity, I want you to guess or get an estimate of how many you think will fit here. Like, how many of your fireflies will fit here? Maybe three, two, I don't know. Maybe, and then I want you to do it here. And then how many for a float jar? And then we're gonna talk about this later, okay? I cannot wait to see what you guys come up with. All right, so that's that activity. We are also, going to expand on our sentences that we built the other day, our sentence creations. So yeah, the other day in our Zoom meetings, we worked with our hunt life cards, the picture cards of things, um, animals and flowers and things that you find around the pond. And then we used words to build sentences. And we're gonna expand on that in small groups today, okay? And then on um, our art project for today, we are going to create a pattern snake. So you will use the paper plate that you have in there. You're gonna draw like a little head and then some swirlies and then we're gonna make patterns on his back and then we're gonna cut it out to make a paper plate snake. He's gonna be really cute. Okay. I cannot wait to get started with our small groups today. We're gonna have so much fun. But right now, let's go ahead and jump into our morning meeting. All right, I'm gonna start sharing the screen. Alrighty guys, what do we do first? Our calendar, that's right. So what day is today? What day is today? Right, here's what our calendar looks like. You'll see all of our days up here at the top. And we're gonna go to the next slide because yesterday was Wednesday. Yesterday was Wednesday, April 15th. Today is Thursday, so we moved Wednesday back and moved Thursday down. Today is Thursday, April 16th, 2020. Thursday, that means we're almost to Friday. That's very exciting. All right, so let's go ahead and do our days of the week song. Are you guys ready? All right. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in a week. Awesome. Job. All right, moving right along. What is the weather like at your house today? Is it windy? Is it sunny? Snowy? All right, meet me back here. Um, I think I'm going to count to 15 by ones. All right, meet me back here. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, Alrighty. What is the weather like at your house? Here at school, it is still sunny out, but it is still cool or even cold. I feel like I need a jacket. I'm, it's kind of cold inside as well. Maybe it'll warm up in the afternoon. All right. So I do have a it's story time now, and we have a really exciting book to read today. It's a story by Eric Carl, and it's called The Very Lonely Firefly. And you might have this book at your house, <clears throat> or you might remember it from the week that we talked about Eric Carl because we looked at a lot of his things, okay? So it is time for our KWL charts. You can follow along if you have one at home. You can make one, have any parents or a sibling help you out. Some of the things that I know, I know that there's a firefly that I can see, the cute little guy. I know he has six legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. That makes him an insect. And he lights up. I know he lights up because I used to catch fireflies in the summertime when I was growing up at home. It was so much fun. All right, and then some things I want to know. I'm curious, does he have a name? If so, what is it? And I'm also curious, oh, what makes him light up? How often does he do it? And I want to know why is he so lonely? And I know that he's lonely because that's in the title of the book, Be Lonely, right there. All right, so I'm gonna stop sharing the screen. We're gonna read the book. And I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> okay, let's get started. The Very Lonely Firefly by Eric Carl. It was a long, just kidding. I skipped the pages. All right. As the sun set, a little firefly was born. 
It stretched its wings and flew off into the darkening sky. It was a lonely firefly and it flashed its light, <clears throat> searching for other fireflies. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a light bulb lighting up the night. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a candle flickering in the night. What's going on up here? The firefly saw a light and it flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a flashlight shining in the night. Light up there. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a lantern glowing in the night. What is it? Hey, stop fighting. You can just talk about it. The firefly saw several lights and flew toward them, but there were not other fireflies. There was a dog, ruff, 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 and a cat, and an owl. And they're all, their eyes were reflecting in the light. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a car's headlights flooding the night. Look, wow, it's beautiful. The firefly saw many lights and flew toward them, but they were not other fireflies. They were fireworks sparkling and glittering and shimmering in the night. So pretty. When all was quiet, the firefly flew through the night, flashing its light, looking and searching again. Then the very lonely firefly saw what it had been looking for. A group of fireflies flashing their lights. Now the firefly wasn't lonely anymore. Did you guys like the story? I hope so. All right, so we're going to go back to our KWL part. And some of the things that I learned, uh, it did not mention that he had a name, but he, it did say, say that he was lonely. And I also learned that he... Um, was in search of other fireflies, but he came across many things that at first he thought were fireflies, but they weren't. But in the end, he finds all of his friends, and that's very exciting. All right, so on the next slide are some videos. I've also linked these channels into your tactics report under our morning meeting. And so I hopefully you guys can check those out. All right, well, that, that concludes our morning meeting for today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I can't wait to hang out with you on our Zoom meetings later. And I hope you check out the YouTube channel and watch all of our soul groups because I've had a lot of fun doing them. I miss you guys tremendously and I can't wait to see you. All right. I love you and I'll see you guys later.